sure many of you know what climate change is, but do most of you see it as a big issue? The truth is that most people listen to some politicians or other people without the scientific evidence instead of the actual scientists themselves. It's getting even colder, President Donald Trump stated. There's no such thing as climate change. Representative Robert Aderholt says the Earth is going through a warming cycle, not caused by humans. Most scientists, however, think differently. It has been proven that in the last couple years, we have seen dramatic weather increases. On a graph, a flat line will appear, and it will appear normal until you see a large spike, similar to a hockey stick. Humans are believed to be causing these weather changes, and we have to be responsible for it. If the Earth rises one more degree, which is close to where we are now, slightly over, but then there will be occasional big storms or extreme weather conditions. By the second degree, the coral reefs will completely collapse. If the Earth rises a third degree, heat waves will roll in, making some parts of the world uninhabitable. Once the Earth reaches the fourth degree, agriculture will shrivel and fires will burn out of control. The Earth will start to collect methane under its surface, which will make the Earth heat all by itself, and we won't be able to do anything to stop it. Some parts of the world are already feeling these effects. Glaciers are melting in China, water levels are rising in India, and Miami is flooding. We can stop this mess we have created by simply creating a carbon tax, which was proven by George Gregory Mankey to significantly help stop climate change. A carbon tax will let people know whenever they turn on a car or do anything else that may be bad for the environment not to do it. And already an agreement has been made in Paris. None of the countries can let the weather rise over two degrees, but there was no mention of a carbon tax. We may, be, we may have to do even more than the green states. Climate change is not completely avoidable, Obama says, but we can still end it before a catastrophe. Everyone has to do their part in order to save the world that we live in. Thank you.